Assalamu alaikum students Yesterday we have done reading of page number 21 and 22 and our topic name is life cycles of animals and plants so today we are also going to read this topic and we are going to complete our lesson so today is again our reading day are you ready okay so open your book and come on page number 23 and again you have to listen me carefully you have to read along with me but you have to listen sentences with me then you have to repeat all the sentences with me okay so today we are going to start a reading from multiple fission multiple fission multiple fission okay repeat after me class multiple fission multiple fission okay in some situations the asexual mother is divided into many different tiny babies in some situations the asexual mother is divided into many different tiny babies in some situations the asexual mother is divided into many different tiny babies okay now class repeat this sentence with me in some situations the asexual mother is divided into many different tiny babies okay once again in some situations good the asexual mother is divided into many different tiny babies okay good these babies look like their mother they adapt to their own environment quickly they adapt to their own environment quickly they adapt to their own environment quickly now repeat this sentence with me they adapt to their own environment quickly the babies grow up and reproduce in the same manner in a short time there are many of them in that area in a short time there are many of them in that area in a short time there are many of them in that area it's called the multiple reproductions it's called the multiple reprodu reproductions it's called the multiple reproductions okay repeat after me now it's called the multiple reproductions good multiple means many budding look at this way of asexual reproduction it's called budding it called budding it called budding in this method a bud appears on the body of the mother in this method a bud appears on the body of the mother in this method a bud appears on the body of the mother now you repeat this sentence good very nice good the baby separates from the mother and becomes independent fragmentation 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 another type of asexual reproduction is called fragmentation in this way any one part grows in size in this way any one part grows in size in this way any one part grows in size the grown part then breaks out the broken part then develops a complete body sexual reproduction sexual reproduction requires a mother and a father a baby is born when there are a father and a ma mother its process is difficult and slower than asexual reproduction its process is difficult and slower than asexual reproduction its process is difficult and slower than asexual reproduction now you repeat this sentence its process is difficult and 
slower than asexual reproduction very good but the babies born from sexual reproductions are stronger than the ones born from asexual reproduction the babies who have both the parent can move to a different location they can survive in other environments they can survive in other environments they can survive in other environments now you repeat this sentence good very nice that's because their bodies have good qualities from both the parents this makes them stronger than asexual babies sexual reproduction also takes pla uh, place in plants sexual reproduction also takes place in plants sexual reproduction also take place in plants okay repeat with me sexual reproduction also takes place in plants good the male plant only has flowers the female plant has fruits look at these papaya trees the male papaya tree will not have the fruit it has flowers with pollens it has flowers with pollens it has flowers with pollens the pollens are transferred to the female papaya tree the pollens are transferred to the female papaya tree the pollens are transferred to the female papaya tree the female papaya tree will grow the fruits the fruits will have the seeds a new papaya plant will grow when we saw a seed found in fruit a new papaya plant will grow when we saw a seed found in fruit a new papaya plant will grow when we saw a seed found a found in fruit okay repeat this sentence a new papaya plant will grow when we saw a seed found in fruit excellent some plants have both male and female flowers squash is one such plant the male and female flowers are slightly different from each other the male and female flowers are slightly different from each other the male flower has a stamen in the middle the male flower has a stamen in the middle the male flower has a stamen in the middle now repeat this sentence good very nice the female flower has a budding fruit at the bottom a maize plant has male flower head on the top and female flower heads on the stem the corn is part of the female flower now on the next page we have life cycles of different uh, animals like butterfly cockroach and uh, mosquito so uh, what is your home assignment for today aaj ka kaam aapka bahut interesting hai aapne ye karna hai ki isme se aapne life cycle of a butterfly usko aapne apne page ke upar draw karna hai aur jo jo words wahan par likhe hain jaise wahan par egg hai कैटरपिलर या लार्वा है ये सारे वर्ड्स आपने अच्छे से रीड करना सीखने हैं पूरा लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ अ बटरफ्लाई लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ अ कॉकरोच आपने पेज पर बनाना है और जितना लाइफ साइकिल के साथ जो वर्ड्स लिखे हुए हैं इनको आपने बार बार रिपीट करना है और इसकी तस्वीर लेकर आपने अपने टीचर को सबमिट करनी है आप लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ अ बटरफ्लाई भी बनाइए लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ अ कॉकरोच भी बनाइए और अगर आप चाहें और आप इसमें ऐड करना चाहें तो लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ अ फ्रूट ट्री भी बना लें तो ये तीनों आप बनाने के बाद इसकी अच्छी से एक पिक्चर लेकर अपने टीचर्स को आज का होमवर्क असाइनमेंट सबमिट करेंगे टेक केयर अल्लाह हाफिज़